All right, so in our next part of this assignment is we've got to really look at the photograph and we've got to break it down into two different categories. We want to find the lightest spots possible, and that's these little white, green, bleach spots almost, okay? And then we want to find the darkest spots of, uh, possible that we see on the photograph. And this is where it gets really tricky because it's a printout and the printer doesn't print the colors exactly the way we see it. If we had the real pepper in front of us, we can easily see where the dark spots are, where the shadows are. But uh, because I didn't buy enough peppers for everybody to have one, we're going to work from this photograph. And so I squint my eyes. And when I squint my eyes, I see this really, really dark mass kind of right here that kind of goes down and around. And so what we're going to be doing is we're going to be making irregular shapes, okay? We're not going to try to draw them exactly how we see them. Uh, we're trying to draw placement and size. And so I'm going to start with this kind of like horseshoe shape right here. And so what I'm going to do is I'm just looking for the, the first, the easy ones, these little white bleach spots. And I'm just going to try to put them where I see them wherever I happen to see them and, you know, approximate size and placement. Again, feel free to, you know, pause me as you need to. I'm not worried so much about exact, you know, making them look exactly like they do. Again, I'm going to allow you to have a little bit of freedom to kind of, you're just worried about placement and size. Now there's another one that goes all the way down here and then there's this little spot right here. And so again, like I said, you can pause me as you need to. All right, and now that I have those, now I'm going to be looking for this really dark masses, and there's really three of them. There's one, this funny one I was telling you about, and then there's this one on this side. And so same thing, all I'm going to do is just kind of squint my eyes and try to capture the sh overall shape of these objects that I see. You'll notice this one in the middle kind of looks like a weird W. You'll also notice that they actually correspond to where these light areas are, so I don't need to draw the top part because the top part it goes into those little white spots. <laughs> 